all our valued participants wholeheartedly and we do have the Amphil scholars in the STEAM education as presenters, namely uh, Mrs. Kavita Baral, Mr. Kilnarayan Rashta, Mr. Harsha Bahadur Chan, and uh, Mr. Uh, Sandeep Dungana, and I myself, the Amphil scholar, Mr. Amrit Kundari. Thank you. And uh, uh, yes, uh, so well, without any further ado, uh, I would like to request Professor Bal Chandra Luitel sir to have an opening remark. Sir, over to you. Is the mic. Thank you very much, uh, Amrit sir. Uh, are we all Nepali here? Or are we all in Nepali? Is it okay? Okay, fine. 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 If you, if somebody, sometimes we would have friends from Philippines and uh, Indonesia, but today it seems that we all are exclusively Nepali group. That's okay. Um, what I feel like so, when I hear our family, JLI, um, one on a art, one on so art, one ego say, art is a product, when you go, art is a thing, but I got it, Tari Gabani. Um, Amro Oil is an Adonic Kisavli. आधुनिक शिक्षा को विकास संस्थाएं आर्ट और साइंस लाइज हैं अथवा कला और विज्ञान लाइज छुट्टियाँ और पढ़ाओं ने पढ़ा ये उड़ा सुपरियर हो ये उड़ा इंपीरियर हो अथवा ये उड़ा काम लागने को ये उड़ा खासे जीवन में काम लाग देने ये सारी चीज़ सोच सोचियो खास करी हो चाहिए आधुनिक शिक्षा प Industrialization of the Borons of Nicaragua. This is a management matching of Tylerian management, objective based management system, but you tell me scientific management of paradigm. But what you think, Bishop Sotabico, Ukla Biku, the Testigar Six Yamapani, Ralph Uta Taylor management, Tyler Ralph Tyler, let's say, you objective based curriculum design, but in 1949, you know, you know, science becomes, became a meta-narrative. Science is a meta-narrative, science is a meta-narrative. In the 1960s, when you were in the beginning of Nepal, you were in the beginning of the revolution, or the movement in the beginning. यो शुरू हुआ है क्यों क्यों मतलब ये उड़ा चाहिए क्यों क्यों बंदा करी ये उड़ा चाहिए जो पोस्ट स्ट्रक्चरलिस्ट मोमेंट थे लेकिन क्यों बंदियों बने वही ना वही ना जो साइंस लाई बुझने तोर तरीका अथवा कला लाई बुझने तोर तरीका ये उटे ही होता है ना फरक फरक कौन सा साइ बिगियन ले ये उड़े I know it's a it's a paradigmatic approach. Science is also paradigmatic. Oh, this means I mean, like Newton could do it. This means Einstein could do it. You know, for us, science is also paradigmatic. This is the first thing. Something that we have to do. Why do we want to hear? We start a certain technological innovation. Technological innovation. Start. So, this is the internet. Start. My army could control. That is, when the nineties was the internet, ICT, that different. चुन 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 अब अनु नावायो प्रोग्रामिंग करने करा रहे हो ये करा रहे हो से पब्लिक होना था ले तो तेले एक प्रकार को बात आप लोग क्यों बनाई दियो बंदा केरी वो हो यो जो ना मिले टेक्नोलॉजी बन जाके कैसा हो टेक्नोलॉजी बने को वास्तव में विज्ञान को परिधि भी प्रमाणित है राउंड ओर इन्हें सा इसमें क्रिएटिविटी बिज्ञान लाये ना कहले कहे कला चाइन्स है कला लाये ना कहले कहे बिज्ञान चाइन्स है यू कुरा अपने शुरू करो तो यही तो हमारा पश्चिम उत्तर में बात है कला जहाँ पर नहीं जोड़ी इंसान पर टेक्नोलॉजी लाई और जो बड़ी कला समझ जोड़ने था ली है ना आर्ट समझ जोड़ने था ली टेक्नोलॉजी मात्र है ना बिज्ञान एवढा इस इस बात जून दंगा ले पब्लिक फेस में से यो वितरण एवढा सिस्टम देखें सा स्ट्रक्चर देखें सा क्यों वही ना आई यो जति केरा यो विकास उन सा विकास उन ला केरी यो वितरण देरे क्यों सारू देरे नॉन लिनियर नॉन लिनियरिटी आरु उन्सन जसरी आमिले लिनियर एवढा फॉर्म में से आई ना 
हमी प्रेडिट कर टेस्ट कर इवालुएट कर पब्लिक में हम तेरी बुझ् तो हिसाब से मत विज्ञान बनाया है विज्ञान में कला को डाइमेंसन प्रशस्त है जसरी कला बुझना हमीर विज्ञान को सीस्टम भी बुझ् जरूरी है ये हिसाब से हमी पचिल समय में अलग पीछे तो मैं बताऊन ही पर्दन कला रिज्ञान आर्थ आर्ट्स रइंस जोड़ने विभिन्न अब एक्रोनिम बनाया जो हमें स्टीम को जो ओरिएंटेशन छ कला जोड़ि पर्च हम तस्ते कर तब को अरुण क्षेत्र में जो विज्ञान पढ़ाने विज्ञान अप्रोच करने तरीका विभिन्न आर्ट बेस्ड अप्रोच आर्ट बेस्ड पेडागजिकल मोडल अलग पड़ी विवास भाषा रर्ट्स डिपर्टमेंट में विज्ञान प्रस्तुत करने कुछ विभिन्न कलात्मक ढंग ने विज्ञान कसरी प्रस्तुत कर सकता है भाई कुरा अलग पछाड़ी एकदम प्रयोगात्मक स्टेज में धेरे पेपर के विषय में आई राख धेरे टीचर एजुके एजुकेटर इसमें काम कर कई सन्दर्भ में हम का विश्वविद्यालय स्कूल अफ एजुकेशन में जी खेरा हमें स्टीम एजुकेशन को प्रोग्राम सुरू गये तीखे हमी इन्विजन के आर्ट्स बेस्ड पेटेगाजी हमें आर्ट्स बेस्ड रिसर्च भी पढ़ा तो आर्ट्स बेस्ड पेटेगाजी इज एन इज एन इंपोर्टेंट स्टेप अहेड फर अल फर्स्ट टू रियलाइज स्टीम एजुकेशन तो हिसाब से आज साथी जे जी क्लास में क्लास एक्टिविटी को रूप में अथवा कुछ एसाइनमेंट को रूप में काम कर प्रोजेक्ट को रूप में क्लास बेस्ड प्रोजेक्ट रूप में काम करे आज सेयर कर यहाँ सब अब इस अलग इंटरैक्टिव बनाई दिवन मनोध करते अब ममृत जी ओवर टू यू थैंक यू वेरी मच लेट्स बिगिन as uh, thank as uh, thank you very much sir for the uh, wonderful uh, remarks or the insightful th uh, thought about uh, arts uh, so if we have a desire to innovate uh, like why art education that it benefits from a whole dose of like science or maths or technology or uh, let's say engineering then i guess it's uh, your session so i have seen uh, much more participants from all walks of life धेरे बिदा यहाँ मैं साथी देखी रखु रट द सेम टाइम आई डू आई हेव सीन लड अफ सीनियर्स फ्रम दिस वेबिनार सीरीज रामी एज अ आर्ट बेस्ड पेडागोजी संबंधी हमारा साथी प्रेजेंट करते हुए सो आई गेस वी अल आर एक्साइटेड अबाउट दिस थिंग एंड आई डोट नो व्हाट्स बीइंग कुक्ड इन साइड बट आई गेस वी अल आर इगर टू हियर द स्टोरीज अबाउट हाउ हाउ आर्ट्स इट ऑल द प्रॉब्लम्स आर टू सी the connections of uh, one discipline to the next one just i am seeing map on science technology engineering arts mathematics is so we are like i mean integral tarika le hamile hamro bujai hamro teaching pedagogy ma hamile kasari apply garne athwa anya kura har lai pani hamile kasari empathize garna sakinchha yi harek kura haru hamro sathi haru le aaja kehi discuss garnu huncha ra at the same time i am feel in steam education so steam department ku ma cha i guess the very party if you she want to join then it's your uh, it's your subject matter well so without any delay let's observe and look closer um one gentle reminder to you all there will be 20 minutes each for the presenter and it is followed by the question and answer session so don't forget to pose the question in our chat box sathi le present gardai garda tapai haru ma ke jigyasa ke questions haru cha bhani krupa chat box ma tapai le lekhna saknu hunecha ra chat box ma lekhi sake pachadi so at the end of the session hami floor discussion ma janchau ra ti bela ma pakka pani tapai ko queries haru solve hune cha bhanne vishwas ko sath i guess shall i pass the mic to uh, Um, uh, Mrs. Kavita Boral, ma'am, if you are there. Yes, sir. Thank ma you, ma'am. Thank you, Amit sir. Let yes. me start. So my the, the mic is yeah. off. Can you hear me? Okay. Good evening, everyone, and namaste, uh, namaste to you all, uh, respected professors, uh, dignitaries, my friends, and all the invitees. Today we are here uh, 
to just make ourselves uh, familiar with the art-based pedagogy. And we are here to uh, share our uh, ideas. We are here to share our thoughts and our uh, the work which we have done as a project work in our STEAM education uh, classes. Here in our group, uh, it's me, myself, Pavita Baral, Sandeep Dungana, Hilnaren Shrestha, Arsala Duchan, um, as a group members from STEAM education department, Kashmir University, presenting this art-based pedagogy. When we just uh, see the word art, then there can be different sort of feelings regarding this art. What do you understand when we say art? Well, like, uh, generally, in, in uh, our context, we just uh, consider the drawing or any canvas we see as art. But art is in different form and it has got different sort of importance it has got different essence also art can be uh, used for the representation uh, of different sort of data which cannot be expressed uh, in textual form to represent uh, different sort of emotions also uh, to different uh, represent different sort of culture and those things which cannot be expressed by our textuals or one oral form, we can make use of art as, a, as expressing uh, our emotions, our feelings, our thoughts. It can also represent our culture. Art is in different form. It has got different genre, like music. It has got a literary art um, as a form. It, it can be like uh, performance art. We can have a uh, different sort of form of art. And we nowadays, we just see um, there is a great importance of this A in this uh, S-T-E-A-M. We used to believe that, or we used to consider that only those subjects uh, like science, technology, uh, engineering and mathematics, they, are, they have got high values. And um, in a later uh, period of time, we consider them as dry subjects also. They don't have any sort of uh, flavor or emotions. Um, but after the introduction of this A in this STEAM discipline, it is uh, integrating, it is acting as uh, the uh, one a medium okay uh, or approach which is just making it uh, more um, more uh, um, which uh, which can express or which can integrate these different uh, stem disciplines into one and uh, it uh, creates the empathy in the students or uh, it uh, just makes the students responsible for the society as well uh, due to these above uh, different reasons, art is considered nowadays as a pedagogy in STEAM approach as well. Why do we require to have this sort of art-based pedagogy then? As it fosters the imaginations of the students, nowadays um, uh, we are just believing, believing about the holistic educations, not uh, on the rote learning uh, or the incoming pedagogy, but in this particular situation, art-based pedagogy will help students uh, to enhance their critical thinking. And uh, similarly, it invokes the intuitions of the learners. Uh, it generates the empathy uh, in the learners so that they will become uh, the socially responsible citizens of the community. It's uh, the art also creates motivations and interest and curiosity in different sort of, uh, subject matter and uh, to develop the concept and ideas also for the learners. Um, Art-based pedagogy uh, hints will help students to uh, do the meaningful learning. 
Similarly, to add on uh, on those different importance of art-based pedagogy, I like um, to help. Uh, I like to consider this fact also that it helps students to achieve the goals of STEAM. Uh, it uh, helps to develop the 21st century skills like communications, collaborations, and uh, critical thinking. Uh, similarly, um, art can be used as a utility uh, to learn different other STEM subjects. It uh, not only fosters the uh, cognitive growth, but also the emotional and psychomotor growth of the learners. Um, in addition to that, it cultivates the creativity and encourages uh, self-expression. Now, to further uh, add on this, uh, I like my friend Hilnaran Shrestasar uh, to begin the next scene. Hilnaran, sir, you are welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Kavita, ma'am. Good evening, all respected teachers, my colleagues, and all participants. Uh, on the basis of the introduction of art-based pedagogy, as Kavita, ma'am, described, uh, I want to uh, present some examples how art is integrated in STEM subject and how can we use art as a pedagogy in STEM subject, but uh, the particular example will be presented later. Your general examples will be presented. As far as uh, the STEM and art relation concern, uh, Marius ETL 2020 presented two axial relationship. Uh, the first relation is one sided in instrumental and non pedagogical relation. This is mainly art dominated relation. The art is uh, used, art uh, uses the stem to express art is dominated. And the next relation is mutually instrumental and non pedagogical relation. Uh, this is uh, the mutually blended of arts and stem discipline, but uh, they are not uh, each other for learning purpose, so it is non-pedagogical. The third relation describes uh, the STEM is the dominated and STEM uses art as pedagogy. So the main uh, objective of this, this relation is to foster the STEM concept, practice and principles through the arts and it is related to art-based pedagogy. The fourth relation is uh, mutually instrumental and pedagogical. So it is the interdisciplinary uh, relationship where the art and the STEM subject blend each other for uh, mutual learning and uh, mutual benefits. Next slide, please. Uh, with regard to the curriculum perspective, uh, how the art is integrated in uh, curriculum, uh, Bezurik 2015 uh, uh, presents the three aspect of uh, curriculum uh, in arts. Uh, first aspect is art as curriculum, which is the art dominated curriculum. It is art education. And the second one is uh, art enhanced curriculum. It is uh, related to art based pedagogy, where the uh, different subject concepts can be learned through the arts. And the third one is art integrated curriculum. It is the interdisciplinary perspective where the uh, different subjects, STEM subjects and art integrate uh, uh, for the mutual benefit and mutual learning. Next slide. With regard to the forms of art, as Kavita uh, Ma'am already stated, there are uh, different forms of art uh, different literatures describes the different forms. Generally, we uh, discuss here the uh, visual arts, performance arts, and literary arts, and how these arts uh, are used in our pedagogical uh, practices. Uh, I, uh, now, I want to um, present some examples 
uh, of such art, uh, how these are related to our teaching learning practices. Uh, in mathematics, uh, some uh, to be, to these shapes uh, can be presented. Uh, the students where uh, they involved in making such uh, shapes uh, understand the structure of the um, shape. Their structure understanding on structure uh, helps to understand the further learning. Uh, similarly, next please. Uh, 3D shapes uh, in mathematics and science uh, provides the clear concept about the structure of different uh, shapes uh, and different uh, structure of molecules, uh, structure of different functional structures also. So uh, it is uh, when a student involved in such activities, uh, they have uh, developed the creativity as well as they um, become the clear about the concept and theories which is underpinning about uh, underpinning on these shapes similarly uh, collage making uh, this is the form of uh, art where the students prepare uh, and demonstrate different activities uh, or structures um, by using pasting the uh, objects like paper and other cottons and other things on paper uh, so they express uh, the phenomenon and understanding on um, collage so this is also a form of art we can use these forms uh, as a um, art-based pedagogy Next slide, ma'am. Up there, ma'am. Uh, painting is another form of um, art uh, in science and mathematics. It has a great role. Uh, um, drawing and painting, drawing uh, different shapes, structures, uh, and the um, functions also we can represent by painting uh, this painting also helps to imagine uh, the students about the phenomenon uh, which is going around their them uh, and uh, express their feeling on uh, feeling and understanding uh, towards the concept so it is also an important form of art which can be used as pedagogy next uh, food art uh, this uh, also demonstrate the cultures and we can relate uh, such type of arts to uh, teach about to learn about the symmetry asymmetry uh, different shapes uh, different uh, designs and uh, we can also learn about the animals and plants their characters and this uh, this is also the expression of culture uh, so uh, it is also a form of pedagogy next gaming is also another form of art various kinds of gaming some are performance uh, based gaming some are the literary gaming uh, can be used in science we can use bingo some uh, uh, in some concept we can use the dominoes jeopardy hangman out some gamings are um, can be used in online mode and some are uh, can be used in physical mode uh, so it uh, it is also an important form of art uh, to uh, present the concept to enrich the learning in stem uh, subjects similarly uh, the herbarium construction is the popular activity in uh, biology teaching as well as scrapbook can be used as the uh, pedagogical um, purpose uh, where the students pre uh, present their ideas uh, figures and their drawings and uh, informations in artful way and it is a kind of uh, diary taking uh, where um, they this is uh, also acts as the portfolio of the students uh, so it also can be used as the uh, assessment um, tools also 
making wall magazine magazine is a collaborative work uh, student can present uh, story poem different uh, important information and drawing and different types of games uh, in the same wall uh, so uh, they uh, learn from the sharing and it is better to present uh, the uh, magazine in thematic uh, approach so that uh, the students can present on the their ideas in certain content after uh, the certain duration of teaching so it is also important way of uh, presentation of art next ma'am a role play and drama this is uh, performance art where students engage in uh, acting uh, the different characters they play the characters uh, and in uh, classroom setting we can use uh, this time of type of role play and drama to uh, demonstrate the characteristics of plants animals or any other non living uh, matters also so the students learn the concept learn their nature and they become uh, expressive too and they become creative uh, and they have different uh, imaginative uh, skill development also along with the concept uh, next way is uh, the concept map or mind map uh, which is uh, the uh, expression of summary of the lesson uh, as well and uh, here the different concepts ideas can be linked to each other and, and the student uh, can present one student can present in one way whereas other another student can you uh, present in another way so there is the multiple way of expression too and this also can be used as instrument uh, instrument for uh, the assessment also <clears throat> thank you this is uh, the some general examples of uh, art based pedagogy where we can use in uh, science and math teaching or other uh, stem subject teaching uh, now um, we are going to present uh, the particular example how uh, the art based pedagogy can be used for a particular lesson teaching uh, to continue this uh, i request to harshvadu uh, chandu sir over to you sir thank you kian sir uh, good evening to all uh, let me continue our presentation on art based pedagogy uh, relating it with uh, mathematics teaching and for this, we have selected a pyramid from the great 10 mathematics. And in mathematics learning, uh, there are two types of objects, uh, direct objects and indirect objects, where direct objects are fact, skill, concept, and principle. And indirect object includes problem solving, transfer of learning, and theorem proving. And here, uh, we have designed activities uh, for the concept, skill, uh, principle, and problem solving. That is, we will concern on these objects of learning only. And uh, to facilitate learning, uh, we will use different form of arts and uh, visual arts, for example, uh, drawing and painting, performing arts uh, like uh, storytelling and literary art as well. And uh, to, to, to facilitate learning, teachers need to have uh, uh, instructional resources as well. For example, laptop, projector, GeoGebra software, uh, pyramid, different colors, a pencil, thread, juice pipe of different colors, and textbook. And here we have mentioned projector, uh, thread, and text. Uh, these objects also uh, because uh, our activities uh, are mainly um, designed for the face-to-face -face, uh, learning situation uh, but uh, the activities that we have designed are equally uh, effective for the uh, online teaching as well uh, and uh, at the end of uh, activities that we have designed students will be uh, able to explain the meaning of different terms related to pyramid they will be able to derive formula for the uh, literal surface area and total surface area of pyramid they will be able to find literal surface area and total surface area of pyramid. 
and they will be able to solve real world problems related to surface area of square based pyramids and uh, these objectives are concerned with the different levels of Bloom's taxonomy. Here, understanding is uh, the lower level of uh, thinking, but uh, create, uh, apply uh, are the higher order uh, thinking abilities. Therefore, uh, we uh, we try to um, address uh, lower level as well as uh, higher order thinking abilities from our art-based activities. Uh, to familiarize students with the different terminologies of pyramids, different teachers might different type of teaching methods. And uh, many of teachers in, in this time period are using the lecture method and such methods uh, might not be suitable uh, for the meaningful learning. That is why we have uh, designed one of the uh, poem uh, to familiarize students with the um, terminologies of pyramid. Uh, and uh, uh, before explaining the reason of uh, creating this poem rather than the definitions of terminologies, uh, I, um, I request uh, uh, K.N. Thank you, sir. For the recitation uh, let me recite. Poem. Square base pyramid ma five faces one Triangular face le common point a vertex a light chun chun only one square face a ta baki triangle <coughs> triangular face a ustai ustai farak na unne square face lai base ban incha tesko center uncha te center a vertex jor da pyramid height bancha. Vertex bata base ko side ma perpendicular kis nu this slice slant height ko bane ra buj nu square ko area ne base area man ne triangular face ko triangle ne lateral area than ne chuna sakne sabai face le total surface ban cha Tay surface ko yeri ya lighti yes ye ho bancha. Thank you. Thank you, Ken sir. And uh, now uh, let me present it in different way uh, uh, in the style of the uh, Jamma Jamma, which is uh, the songs sang by Nanda Krishna Joshi of one of the um, singer of Far Eastern uh, Development Region. Uh, and uh, uh, let me start it. A square based pyramid ma five faces hun chan jamma 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 triangular face le common point a vertex lai chun chan jamma 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 only one a square face ta baki triangles hune jamma 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 Triangular face ustai ustai kai farak na hune jamma 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 square face lai base banincha tesko center huncha jamma 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 te center ra vertex jodda pyramid height bancha jamma 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 vertex bata base ko side ma perpendicular khichnu jamma 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 te sai lai slant height ra ho bhanera bujnu jamma 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 square ko area nai base area manne jamma 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 Triangular Pesco area and a literal area tan ne jamma 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 jamma. Tuna shakne pesale tuna shakne shall be pesle total surface of bonsa jamma 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 jamma. Pay sharpesco area like TS reho bonsa jamma 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 jamma. Thank you, Ken, sir. And I hope that you have enjoyed it. And similarly, uh, teachers can create their own uh, different poems and uh, they uh, they may ask their students to recite in the different ways relating with their cultures. And uh, uh, this activity might uh, uh, help uh, to relate mathematics with the uh, cultural uh, heritage also. For example, I have uh, re I related it with the uh, Jamma Jamma song. Similarly, in this way, students might be very interested to learn they might be very curious to learn in learn mathematics through the uh, song also 
and uh, regard uh, and uh, in uh, in place of definition we have created here poem uh, because of uh, such motivation interest and so on such types of factors and uh, many concepts like total surface area lateral surface area slender height height of the pyramid uh, up to so on these terminologies can be best understood by uh, such types of poems uh, that is why we have mentioned here uh, poem next slide and uh, after uh, familiarizing with the uh, many terminologies of the pyramid uh, we have uh, developed some uh, technological activities that will help with students uh, for the concept learning. That is, there are many concepts related to pyramid and for the conceptual learning of uh, such types of uh, concepts, uh, we have created some uh, technological uh, activities also. And technology can be used as a tool uh, and it is uh, it can be used as means to end. That is, end is here learning of mathematics, learning of, uh, of pyramid, but we use technology as a means to facilitate uh, that learning. Uh, and technology, yeah, it saves money in the sense that a teacher, might, a teacher can develop different teaching materials without purchasing any single piece from the market. And it saves time also because uh, a complex type of teaching materials can be developed in a small amount of time. That is why technology saves money and time also. And it facilitates uh, learning of the three-dimensional objects also. It helps to understand the three-dimensional concepts, for example, cone, cylinder, etc. Uh, and it also helps to make invisible things visible. That is, uh, we... we Many people think that mathematics is abstract thing and uh, mathematics has no relationship with uh, real life context also. But uh, mathematics uh, can be visualized uh, from the help of the technology. We can visualize invisible parts uh, of the mathematical content with the help of technology and art. Therefore, we can use uh, technology as a tool to develop uh, artistic um, product also. Uh, next slide, ma'am. <clears throat> and here we have developed, we have created one of the conversation uh, to develop the concept uh, of the components of pyramid. And before the conversation, uh, please, Kapita, ma'am, use your profile. Here, uh, this is one of the uh, GeoGebra file and in which we can see the different faces and one of the faces is blue colored and uh, some faces are there. One of the faces is uh, green colored and the red colored, uh, black colored, uh, as well as uh, yellow colored surfaces. And uh, we can see their uh, height, uh, we can see there uh, some other lines also uh, is cast in the uh, figure. Thank you, ma'am. And for the on the basis of this uh, this uh, this uh, figure uh, now uh, let's begin conversation between aditya and richa mm -hmm. Ma'am, please share it in a presenting mode. Oops, I think it's shareable. I think it's been shared. I'm yeah, shared. I can see two different screens. The next slide is also visible there. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think, yeah. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Two screens, yeah. The slide, are you, are you sharing the slide? Presenting mode, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, You might make it like oh, Thank you. Uh, hello, Richa. Pyramid ko component ko baare ma kura garo na. Unsa ni? Kura shuru garo na ka. Aki kavi tamam bani ko blue color face le pyramid ko base banao sa. Love banata. Kun kun rang le lateral face banao sa. 
मलाई त पुरै कविता याद छ नि लेटरल सरफेस रेड ग्रीन यल्लो र ब्ल्याक रङमा छन् यी सबै ट्रायंगुलर फेसको बीचमा के सम्बन्ध होला तरिसा ट्रायंगुलर फेसहरु कम्बोरेन्ट हुन्छन् भन्ने पुरा बिर्सेको हो र म कहाँ बिर्सिनु तिमीलाई पो सोधेको त चित्रमा पिरामिडको उचाई देखाउन सक्छौ त अ किन नसक्नु चित्रमा पिरामिडको उचाई P ले जनाउँछ किनकि पिरामिडको सेन्टर P र भर्टेक्स E जोडेको छ हो ठीक भन्यो अब पिरामिडको स्लेन्ट हाइट कुन होला त EN होला किनकि भर्टेक्स E बाट बेसको साइडमा त्यसको परपेंडिकुलर भनेको E नै हो ल बधाई छ तिमीले पिरामिडका भागहरु चिनेकी रहेछौ धन्यवाद आदित्य ओके थ्यांक यु एन्ड इन दिस वे वी वी माइट गिव कन्सेप्ट अफ द डिफरेंट पार्ट्स कम्पोनेंट्स अफ पिरामिड विथ द हेल्प अफ कन्भर्सेसन विथ द हेल्प अफ कन्भर्सेसन एन्ड युजिङ द जियोजेब्रा टुल नेक्स्ट म्याम एन्ड mathematics is not abstract subject and we can relate mathematics with the our daily life context also we our culture also therefore uh, to relate mathematics with the culture we have de- we have developed short uh, conversation and uh, let's begin this conversation also erala sankar mara ta kavita sundha ta ananda ayo तर यो पिरामिड मैले कतै देखे जस्तो चाहिँ लागेन त मैले त देखेको छु काव्य तिमीले पनि पक्कै देखेकी छौ होला एकछिन विचार गर त पक्कै थाहा पाउने छौ कहाँ देखेको छु भन त अ तिमी काठमाडौँको मान्छे पशुपतिको मन्दिर त पक्कै गएकी छौ होला अनि मन्दिरको सबैभन्दा माथि देखेर कस्तो कस्तो आकार छ देखे देखेकी छैनौ विचार गर त मेरो आकार तिनी दुबई जनाले चिनी सक्यो यिनीहरूमा स्क्वायर बेस पनि छ उस्तै उस्तै चारवटा ट्रेङ्गल पनि छन् सबै ट्रेङ्गल एउटै ठाउँमा मिलेका पनि छन् त्यसैले तिनीहरू पनि पिरामिड नै हुन् इन दिस वे वी क्यान रिलेट म्याथमेटिक्स विथ आवर डेली लाइफ कन्टेक्स्ट अल्सो that is we can make our learning uh, learning of students meaningful uh, and these are some uh, photos of the uh, our cultural heritage uh, uh, that are related to the pyramid next slide and uh, after these activities uh, we may engage our students uh, in the experiential learning that is uh, if students get opportunity uh, to have experience of something then their learning might be meaningful their learning learning might be authentic therefore uh, it is better to engage students in the experiential learning that is hands on activities that is why uh, we have uh, designed here uh, some artistic uh, teacher should engage Uh, his or her students in developing different artistic model different manipulative model models and sculpture as well and after designing such uh, materials uh, teacher uh, have to engage uh, teacher have to ask their students uh, to um, to demonstrate uh, their performance working in the group collaboratively and for such types of activities we we as a teacher can use low cost materials and local materials as well and in this way these activities help in experiential learning and when students get opportunity of the some opportunity of some experience then the learning becomes meaningful therefore uh, such types of activities are mainly helpful in the meaningful learning of mathematics uh, as well as the uh, relational understanding as well next and uh, um, in addition we can uh, we can engage our students in drawing and painting activities also because drawing and painting activities uh, helps students in the in developing problem solving ability as well as in developing the creativity 
uh, imagination and spatial understanding also because when students are engaged in the uh, drawing and painting activities they have to think uh, very deeply therefore uh, their uh, their deep thinking ability also uh, can be increased with the help of drawing and painting activities therefore uh, for the understanding uh, of the uh, pyramid concept also um, teacher have to engage uh, students in the drawing and painting activities and after they draw uh, and after they have paint something uh, then uh, teacher might in, uh, teacher might say them uh, for the reflecting reflective writing also and till now all the activities are related to uh, development of concept only uh, and familiarizing with the terms of the pyramid and now we can uh, we can derive formula as well through the help of the art and in this you know, for this we have uh, we have created a conversation uh, between a students uh, for the derivation of the formula uh, and we will not use here uh, lecture method and pure discovery method in the lecture method learning uh, there is uh, very less chance of meaningful learning and in the pure discovery method uh, students uh, below average students might not uh, get uh, such benefits therefore uh, we have created here a structured conversation and from that structured conversation a student might uh, uh, students might have meaningful learning and for this students uh, teacher need to have divide uh, the whole class into different groups students will uh, engage in the group activity uh, and uh, in for this case also we may use different type of technological tools like GeoGebra, Demos, uh, up to so on and here we have selected GeoGebra uh, as a technological tool uh, and uh, after uh, the derivation of formula, we can engage students in the application of uh, formula to uh, solve the routine exercise also. Next. And uh, before uh, the before derivation of formula with the help of conversation, uh, please GeoGebra file, open GeoGebra file. And on the basis of that file, we will conduct this activity. Here we can see one of the face uh, is a blue color, and the remaining all faces have same color. And we can see their height, length, height as well. Uh, and on the basis of uh, this GeoGebra file, now uh, let's start conversation. Hello, Richa. Can you the pyramid to base area? What is the base area? Base area is the square area. What is the triangle area? 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 the triangle area? the triangle and if fully multiply the area, the triangle area is the same. area line. This area is the same. 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 Here, now the tsunami is the same. This area is the same. This area is the same. This area is the same. This Yes, so hobane, TSA Baneko, base area, or lateral surface area, some by you. Our major Nagarika Nathium Pyramid Co, LSA, or TSA Cosser Nical Neolata. Service symbols in a Vaikutata. Base co side length lie A, pyramid co height lie at, or slide slant height lie L in a Vaikutta. These symbols are a prior formula and derivation in a Vai. Escalagi saw like a Sodona. Hota, Sodona. La, our group my discussion garde, Kormosa, the pyramid co e formula aru, pota lagaway. Thank you. In this way, we uh, we have created uh, conversation, and in this conversation, we have. Uh,
uh, is structured in sequential manner and that sequence is very helpful for the procedural understanding that is uh, instrumental understanding as well uh, in addition we have mentioned the reason for each step that is answer of why is also mentioned there therefore what and why are answered in this uh, conversation and what and why is related to the relational understanding therefore this type of conversation might, is helpful for the relational understanding as well as uh, instrumental understanding also uh, next time <clears throat> and uh, on the basis of that conversation students might easily uh, derive the formula and the formula are given here next one and we have uh, one objective related to the developing problem solving ability on the students and for the problem solving ability uh, we have uh, created one story and with the help of storytelling uh, we will try to uh, try to develop a problem solving ability in pyramid and uh, storytelling uh, helps in the authentic learning because in every story there is a presence of context and when we uh, mention context the learning uh, might be authentic learning and whenever uh, any person tell a story we try to imagine uh, imagine characters we imagine the story context as well therefore it helps in our imaginative activity imagination also therefore it helps in imagination uh, creativity uh, it develops a thinking ability uh, it uh, uh, develops curiosity in the students for learning and uh, it helps in uh, to for the motivation as well uh, and uh, uh, one of the student might uh, one of the student will tell the story and uh, all groups were already created and the each group uh, will be engaged in finding the solution of the problem uh, mentioned in the uh, mentioned in the story uh, and uh, finally uh, there will be group presentation and a story is like this uh, for the story i request uh, k and sir thank you also sir euta gaun ma ek jana ganit premi vriddha ra unki chori renu basdate ek din ग्रामा बाहिर गएको बेलामा आफ्नो घरको पूर्वतिर रेनुले एरिया 36 स्क्वायर फिट भएको स्क्वायर सेप बनाएर त्यसमा ग्रीन कलरले रंगाएकी थिइन् छोरीले निकै आकर्षक सेप बनाएको देखेपछि गामाको मनमा गणितीय ज्ञान राम्रो भएको व्यक्तिसँग छोरीको बिहे गरिदिने विचार आयो एक गणिती गणितीय प्रश्न राख्छु जसले सबैभन्दा छिटो र सही उत्तर दिन्छ उसैसँग छोरीको विवाह गरिदिन्छु भन्ने उसले विचार गर्यो उसले यो खबर नजिकको गाउँमा गरायो र एक दिन बर छनोटको कार्यका लागि विवाह सभाको आयोजना गर्यो विवाह सभाको दिन सबै गाउँलेहरू ठीक समयमा उपस्थित भइसकेपछि गामाले प्रश्न राखे त्यहाँ 36 स्क्वायर फिट को स्क्वायर सेप मा हरियो रंग लगाएको छ म त्यसमा ओभरल्याप हुने गरी पिरामिड बनाएर कहिले नहटाउने गरी राख्छु र गोल्डन कलरले रंगाउन चाहन्छु 4 फिट उचाई हुने र पारदर्शी सिसाबाट निर्माण गरिने उक्त पिरामिड को एउटा पुरै फेस बाट छोरीले बनाएको आकर्षक डिजाइन देख्न सकिने गरी काम पूरा देख्न सकिने गरी बाकी पूरै भागमा प्रति स्क्वायर फिट रुपीज 500 पर्ने गोल्डन कलर लगाउँदा कलरिंग को जम्मा खर्च कति लाग्ला यो प्रश्न सुनेपछि सबै जना उत्तर मिलाउन तिर लाग्छन् धेरै जनाले उत्तर निकाल्न सकिरहेका थिएनन् यो देखेर गामा चिन्तित हुँदै थिए अन्तमा एक एक जना युवाले 
एकजना युवा पुगे प्रश्न सुनने बितीक सही उत्तर दिए युवा में गणित ज्ञान राम ठहर करते ऊ छोरीस को बी छोरी को बिहार उसेसंग तैयार भे उनके खर्च भी लगे थे होलां उसे कति खर्च लगे होलां अक्षर अलग सामू भाग बीच बीच में ड्रप भैंक यू and in this way there is context and uh, on the basis of this context there is a story and there is a problem also uh, and who, who problem uh, related to the surface area that we have uh, discussed on the other uh, activities next one and such types of story uh, uh, helps in uh, creative imagination also and after all these activities related to uh, concept understanding related to terminology and uh, related to uh, formula derivation as well uh, now uh, each teacher might uh, take uh, assessment of higher abilities uh, in with by using these uh, for example a teacher might uh, ask to students for the uh, for writing their reflection of the experience as well as teacher might create some contextual problems and students have to solve such types of problems and one of the most important activity is that there are already groups in the class and each group will create uh, some question and uh, for example if there are five groups then uh, each group will show, form question create question and question of group a has to be solved by group b similarly b y c and c in this way uh, each group will uh, create question and each group will solve question of another group as well and in this way uh, we have developed uh, different activity art based activities uh, to give the concept as well as skill and problem solving uh, ability of the students and finally our conclusion is that uh, art innovative innovative pedagogy in school education it means art based pedagogy is very innovative and it might be very helpful for the different subjects in the school education for example uh, science uh, mathematics uh, etc and there are several forms of arts that can be integrated to facilitate students about a single topic for example uh, we have used different different form of arts uh, to develop the concept of the pyramid and art based pedagogy increases students engagement and collaboration uh, similarly it also fosters the higher order thinking abilities in the students and local materials can be used in uh, art based pedagogy and which are helpful in the reducing cost as well thank you thank you sir thank you everyone so yes uh, it was really wonderful having you all and uh, mm, so I, I request uh, uh, the participants uh, if you do have any of the queries please uh, you can post there in the chat box so that i can read it and hand over the question to our presenters so bravo kavita ma'am and the team i really like the way that you present the idea regarding the art based pedagogy and this activities uh, that it actually reminds me of uh, the nostalgic uh, days that's bygone and sorry i'm just sorry mr oh, mr sir. Sir, hello okay ajay ajay manish sir okay manish sir uh, thank you thank you for giving giving me time i really enjoyed this presentation uh, varieties of you see art based uh, pedagogical example that you have brought Uh, congratulations not only congratulations my hats up to you all uh, those who presented uh, today it's a, it's a, it's a very very you see reflective uh, on art based pedagogy uh, basically the you see the examples that you brought up the mathematics uh, which is very uh, difficult people say but you see the way you presented might uh, make it um, very useful and 
EG for the students. Now, I would like to add something to your presentation. Um, uh, you see, without associating A with S, without associating A with T, without associating A with E, and without associating A with M, there will be no meaning at all. That's what we 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 uh, emphasize art based pedagogy in our uh, mm -hmm. institutions, right? Whether you talk about cognitive constructivism by Jean Piaget, or whether you talk about social constructivism by Lee Vygotsky, whether you talk about uh, Jacques Derrida's deconstruction, whether you talk about John Dewey's reconstruction of experience, or whether you talk about uh, sociology presented the, the 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 thinking levels of Brooks by taxonomy, right? All call for the art based pedagogy, right? So this is this is this is this is why this art based pedagogy is important. So in short, uh, let me let me let me congratulate you and uh, tell you that art based pedagogy helps learners to co-construct, construct, deconstruct, and reconstruct ideas and foster their creativity. Thank you, friends. Thank you very much for your presentation. I really enjoyed it. Thanks. Thank you, Mona, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for your inspiring remarks. Actually, I have not seen any of the questions there. Much of the friend has uh, said that it's a brilliant presentation. It's wonderful. Congratulations. Uh, saying like, wow, insightful session. Impressive one. Excellent transdisciplinary collaboration by Pratima Thapalia. Yeah, actually, this art integration, it's a, uh, let's say it's a, it's a pedagogical approach that uses uh, uh, one or uh, more art forms like uh, what our friends have used, like visual arts, music, or drama, or dance, that is actually used to deepen the understanding level and it supports the non-arts curriculum like uh, science, uh, mathematics, technology, yeah? And uh, we really enjoy the song there, Jamma Jamma, yeah? And uh, it's... Uh, um, to understand the terminology of pyramid, that's what uh, Arsha sir, Kavita ma'am, Sandeep sir, and Kiel sir, they have used. And the conversation. Okay. Any question? No questions. I think. Yeah. I think it was self-explanatory. This was great. Something I think you can. We can develop a, a book, uh, I think, you know, resource material, probably kills up. You <laughs> now you are you are the main person who can sponsor these kind of, uh, you know, the material production activities through CDC. So <laughs> I think, you know, this is something. Very Thank good. you, sir. I will try my best. Yeah, please. Yeah. I think we can develop supplementary materials exemplary materials in TG as well, like, you know, in, in any grade, from grade to one to grade 12. So I think that would be great. Not like, you know, I know we should encourage teachers to use um, uh, uh, arts-based pedagogy. These arts may be dependent on their context, their indigenous practices, such as Asas are brought Jama Jama, if it was, uh, you know, Purva Tira so you know these are we should be open in the meantime we should be facilitative so i think there is a great role from cdc to play you know sample aru create gar rakhni ni tg ma khas gari teachers guide ma chai kasari arts based garna sakinchha bhanera science math social studies lagayat aru bishoy haru i think we can facilitate or you can, um, you know, you because you represent science group, uh, probably you can also uh, share this experience with uh, other groups as well. So, yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Thank you. Okay, there's, there comes uh, the question. Balmukunda, uh, Bal sir, just one. Balmukunda, sir, asked one question. I think you can support, sir, because you are working in the development sector. Probably you can provide some funding supports and then friends can produce them. Yeah. <laughs> you can, 
very good idea. idea. Yeah. Very excellent idea for a child friendly schooling. We are you know, working on child friendly model, uh, including the art based pedagogy in the early CCD. We are using the uh, collage, uh, letter domino, uh, and you know. picture domino, different materials we are developed. But we are thinking for the early grade reading one, two, three. I mean, the integrated curriculum is uh, uh, integrated in the science, math, uh, and social, also the language part. It is very, very interesting. Your learning, your product is useful. And now we, we can talk, uh, we can speak, and then we can make this learning material, teachers, uh, material, teachers, supplementary guide for the teaching learning. Uh, pedagogy based on the art, art. Uh, it is a very fantastic idea. I'm very much encouraging. And you uh, drag me, you you attract you and whole sessions. Uh, was the principle of the adult learning? Only we can see it uh, 20 minutes, but you whole session you grasp to all the participants. Very very congratulations to all uh, you you guys. Very useful product you produce. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Bal Mukunda, sir. Uh, CDC team will be grateful to collaborate with you for uh, developing such child-friendly resource material. Yeah, yeah really. Uh, we'll, uh, conduct, we'll join to you again. Sure, sure sir. We, we have some, some material for the Early, early childhood development, we, we, we already met, but uh, still we have no for early grade. One, and two, three is very useful for the, those who are very remote. Uh, we can make this uh, resource uh, linking to the TPD model of the teacher training uh, for the, uh, their capacity. Uh, thank you. So one more gentle reminder to you, to everyone. So here comes the attendance link. Please, you can fill the form uh, so that uh, there is, there's a provision of getting uh, the certificate. And uh, that's why, uh, so you can fill the form. There, I have not seen any of the question. And actually, through this this sort of pedagogy, that it helps in uh, the procedural understanding, um, so that the learning that can be maximized. So, Eddie, I mean, you hamro context ma atwa insan experience lai reflect agarno sakiyo bani ani vidya thiar lai agi hamro sadhya lai bani bani as a group ma division garera collaborate garera to arts lai integrate non art subject or ma agarno sakiyo bani. I think. Yeah, gives a my look. So, Vinod uh, sir, if you are there, please. Unun sir, Vinod sir. Yes, sir. I'm here, and then I don't have anything to share. I, I really congratulations to all of you. I really enjoyed the, the, these sessions. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you, Amri sir. Okay, Bal sir, I, I guess you are trying to speak something else, eh? Maine kothi bolne ho, bolay bolay sir. Gore ko jisko ko bolna bolay ho. As there is a Daneva, they are like a gum excellent presentation. Monosoli cave on a hotel. Moile, Moile, your example, your web, Puran Manchali Purana example, Yonsa. Amelia Tapago, radio about a mathematics teaching Surugareco, nineteen ninety Maho, radio education teachers training project, Poela Mo director of Kamgarena, the Swashi Pochi, Amelia, Kigar, radio mathematics in Nicaragua, Cotain example or Lara, Nepali. And Matella Chai translate Guerrera, or to Nepal, Matella Chai adapt Guerrera, only radio Nepal Kakormachari, Keregas, a singer or like Bolar, Tabaka, you great troop of mathematics, total Tabaka, I mean, the Sangitwada, or Togitwada, Pure, teaching Guerra, Pokapurka Pathora, school Amrita experiment Gorego, two a subday Tabago, excellent Tabaka school result, Ago, be there to the sickness of San Manikuro. I have a Git Leon Voyans and Tabaka and different general Leon, the Art Cotain, Story Leon, a Hamilton, your story, 
अनि तपाईको ड्रामा अनि पोएट्री लाई त र सङ लाई त हामीले 1980 देखि टिचर ट्रेनिङ मा युज गरेको गरे हो अ यो तपाईको चाहिँ जुन बेलामा यहाँ टेलिभिजन पनि थिएन इन्टरनेट त कुरै भएन अ त्यसकारण चाहिँ यो यो जेन्डर नेपालमा पहिला पनि युज भएको हो तर यसरी इन्टिग्रेटेड रूपमा चाहिँ युज भएको थिएन तर देयर 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 वाज अ स्टार्ट इन 1980 होइन वी वी स्टार्टेड थ्रु रेडियो भनि एउटा एक्जामपल मात्रै मैले खालि शेयर मात्रै गर्न खोजेको बात हुन्छ हस थ्यांक यू सर एकदम थ्यांक यू भेरी मच अब हामीले त्यसलाई रिभाइभ गर्न पर्यो एकदम अहिले ठीक छ अब यसलाई हामीले कसरी यसलाई मेन स्ट्रिममा ल्याउने भन्ने कुरा चाहिँ अब हामीसँग जस्तो अहिले बालमुकुन्द सर हुनुहुन्छ अब आइएनजीओ सेक्टरमा काम गर्नुहुन्छ खिल सर सरकारकै मान्छे हुनुभयो हामी युनिभर्सिटीका मान्छे भयौँ सो आई थिङ्क वी सुड वर्क टुगेदर एन्ड मेक इट ह्यापेन आई थिङ्क यु नो विल वी एक्सपेक्ट एट एन अदर इन्गेजिङ प्रेजेन्टेसन नेक्स्ट विक थ्याङ्क यू भेरी मच अरू केही भएन भने पनि यहाँ जो जो साथीहरू आउनु भएको छ उहाँहरूले यो कुरालाई इन्टरनलाइज गर्नुहुन्छ र आफ्नो प्र्याक्टिसमा गर्नुहुन्छ आर्ट भनेको पढाइ राख्नु पनि पर्दैन त आफै जेनेरेट हुने कुरा आफै भित्रबाट आउने हो कुरा मनोज सरलाई कविता लेख्न न ज कसैले सिकाएको छ सिकाएको थियो र सर तपाईँलाई कविता लेख्न अब ये ये यस्तै यस्तै तपाईँहरुको प्रेजेन्टेसन आयो भने त्यसले झन् बढी सिकाउनु हुन्छ सर यो भन्दा मैले मैले भन्दा खोजे के हो नि अब आर्टलाई धेरै सिकाउने भन्दा पनि त्यसलाई अनप्याक गर्ने काममा चाहिँ इट कम्स फ्रम विद इन हो सर कसैले सिकाउनु पर्दैन इट कम्स फ्रम विद इन एकदम ठीक छ थ्याङ्क यू भेरी मच अब आजको हामीले यही कन्क्लुड गर्छौँ होला केही छ त अमृत सर छैन सर लास्ट बट नट द लिस्ट दिस इज अ रेगुलर सेसन एन्ड व्हिच कम्स टु यू लाइव अलवेज ऑन सटरडे 5:30 पीएम टिल 7 पीएम हुन त इट्स 48 मिनेट पास्ट 6 सो बट एनीवे हामी सँग धेरै ओन्ली कंग्रेचुलेसन र राम्रो फिडब्याक्स मात्र आएको र क्वेशनहरु धेरै नभएको कारणले गर्दा आई गेस वी नीड टु स्टप हियर सो प्लीज स्टे ट्यून That's what okay. I want to say from Ampel okay. Steam. Second time. Thank you. 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 Thank you.